What's up you guys and welcome again to the channel. It's King Inc here and thank you to all my new subscribers. You guys have really been helping out with the channel. It's been boosting it like crazy. I've been seeing that it's getting a lot more recommended on the explore page and that's fucking awesome to actually see that my videos are somehow getting on the explore page. It may be like limited or I have no idea because I can't specifically check like how much but it is telling me it's featured on the For You page. You guys are getting it recommended at the end of your videos and that's just fucking awesome because we're getting there even if it's just a trickle at first it's gonna turn into a fucking roar later but anyways if you haven't already please go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and make sure to follow me on all my social media down there in the description as well and check out my merch otherwise we're gonna get straight into this vlogtober today it's just gonna kind of be a very realistic morning routine with me right now truthfully i'm having a little bathroom break and then that's it so, you know, first thing in the morning, I get up and I have myself a little bathroom break because I don't know, that's just how my body has been conditioned after years of having to wake up at like six in the morning and going to school and everything. I don't know, it just lingered where I just, the like, thankfully once I am done sleeping, I wake up and boom, I gotta go to the bathroom because that's just how nature is for me. So now we are in the sink area and obviously make sure to wash our fucking hands because I'd be going to the bathrooms and seeing motherfuckers not wash their hand and it's literally the most fucking traumatizing thing ever. Enough of that shit. How the fuck is soap gonna make you gay? Like, be fucking serious. It's not. Grab the fucking bar of soap, fiddle it in your fucking hands and wash your hands. Wash them! And we come over here to the mirror and this is where I stare at myself and ponder upon my life choices and how I'm gonna make that bread. After my initial morning reflection into the mirror, I brush my teeth. Look at that toothpaste on it. This is just a Philips electronic toothbrush that I got as a Christmas gift a long time ago, and honestly, it's been the most incredible thing ever because somehow I actually do have the habit of properly cleaning my teeth. I mean, I do struggle with it sometimes. That's why I have mouthwash for other times when I am struggling, but also, I'm not gonna lie, the second I feel anything, any texture on my fucking teeth, any texture on this enamel, I'm gonna freak the fuck out and I'm gonna take a fucking drill bit to it if I can't get it out. This helps out so that I don't put power tools in my mouth. It's, it's pretty good. So I charge it up, I put my little toothpaste on there. It's whatever's fucking cheapest for now, I'm not gonna lie. So it's this Colgate Cavi Control. Add a little bit of water to it before I start so that it's a little bit juicy, but also not really. <laughs> Brushing my tongue is sometimes a little scary because I'm scared of throwing up, but hella worth it. One thing that I always say is that what's helped me out, whenever I get sick, which it is rarely, sometimes I do get sad about that, but I'm grateful for it because who wants to actually be sick? But I think it was just the only time growing up where I would be able to have a fucking break. So I would get excited to get like a little cold or something like that. But you know, I obviously don't want anything bad to happen. Something that's always helped me and for some reason logically just works for me. And maybe this will help other people too if I just say it. I feel like brushing your teeth even more when you're sick helps it go away a lot faster because if you're already like hacking up, coughing, sneezing, loogies fucking everywhere, like why wouldn't you clean your mouth if it's already like covered and caked in like the bacteria that you've just been like going through and so I feel like it helps like take it out, refresh your mouth so that you can reset and I feel like whatever starts coming out, if you just brush your teeth again, hit it with some mouthwash again, I feel it's a lot better because sometimes I know sometimes we end up like sniffling and just like swallowing everything and it's like weird. Once you brush your teeth, I feel like it helps like either with like my sore throat because sometimes I do have this like allergy issue at least. Sometimes I wake up and my allergies are going crazy. My nose is running, my throat hurts. I just basically like really brush my teeth, brush my tongue. And then after that, I do blow up my nose. I wash up my hands, wash my face and everything because it helps with the stuffiness, helps with the sore throat. And I just feel like washing the sinus and mouth area simply by brushing your teeth and mouthwash 
really helps out with getting through anything like sick. If it's something like simple basic, you know? And then I go ahead and open up here and grab myself some of my deodorant. I use the Old Spice Pure Sport for now. And I will admit the main reason I fucking use this is because it's a cheap double bundle. That's why I have the other one here. That one ran out and this is the second one. A lot of the brands that y'all be seeing me use sometimes at this moment, I will not lie. It's just good value for what I'm getting and it works. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this deodorant. Yo. Make sure to wear y'all deodorant, y'all. There's so many different types of deodorant now too. That's the cool thing. I've always wanted to try spray deodorant. Does that even work? Does it work like well? Or is it just like a conspiracy? I don't know. Like I just feel like, like in the movies when they would spray deodorant on themselves, I thought it was like the most convenient thing ever. And then my favorite part of the morning is picking out what I want to wear today. And today, <laughs> let's see. What does this one say? Replica, me when my ass can't see, by the fireplace. Spooky season. Get with them sprays. Ooh. This one's the nice smoky one that smells like leaves and dirt and wood. Better close up for y'all. This is the little sample of Replica by the Fireplace by Mason Margiela. And to wrap up my morning to routine, the last thing I really do in here is that I go ahead and I brush my hair because honestly, it helps get out all the random lint and things that sometimes get stuck in my hair throughout the night. And funny enough, it has been a lot of fucking lint. And I'm like, damn, dusty head ass, for what? Like, I already got a dry scalp and now I'm working with fucking dust bunnies? Like, shit, might as well start a fucking farm. But yeah, I go through and I brush my hair a little bit. See, as you can see, I'm already struggling a little bit with it. I did hella conditioner last night. So that's why it's at least fluffy. And I think this is just remnant of what ends up like coming up. And yeah, we're gonna be fucking real. Nobody can judge people for having a dry fucking scalp because it's not about being dirty. It's about being fucking dehydrated on your damn scalp. So I'm trying to figure out what I can put in my scalp or what else I can do in my hair routine because I do want to care for my hair. Growing up, I had a really hard time taking care of my hair but now that i'm older it's like my favorite thing ever i really appreciate my hair i want to take care of it and although it is fluffy bouncy and even the bleach part is doing really well and it's not all like crumbly in my hands i want to take care of it so if anybody has any hair care routine recommendations down below in the comments let me know that's gonna be it for the video thank you so much you guys for watching this was my morning routine here with king ink so if you haven't already hit the subscribe button down below follow me on all my other social media and make sure to check out my merch in the link below so thank you so much you guys happy fall and have a good one bye